from the fourth verse we invoke lord rama to protect our body parts for example we invoke raghav or the descendant of raghu to protect our head dasharat maja or the son of dasharat to protect our forehead kausalyaya or the apple of mother kausalya's eyes to protect our eyes vishwamitra priya or the deer of sage vishwamitra to protect our ears as makatrata or the protector of the fire sacrifice to protect our nose we invoke saumitri vatsala or the one affectionate to lakshmana to protect our mouth similar descriptions carry on till verse 9 verse 9 onwards starts the falashruti or the benefits of reciting the stotram now i shall state the benefits the fortunate soul who regularly recites this stotram with love for the lord attains long life happiness children and humility the chanters of rama raksha stotram prosper both materially and spiritually sins do not touch such a devotee and one surely attains mukti